Now hopefully this could turn out liquid green. You see, now we get a nice neat little green in there. We got the goblet, but let's start off with a little bit of corn syrup, okay? So we gotta get some corn syrup in here, but not just corn syrup, we also need some green sugar. Green sugar, a nice line, okay? Some of you looking at this and remember last night. This is different, it's the sugar. So I just run this rim through the corn syrup. Now I coming in on the sugar, bang, bang, bang. Bang, check that out. Nice and green. Get a little bit of ice in here. This one's made in the glass, no blending, easy to do. You could blend this if you wanted. We do a lot of blended drinks, I decided to give you all a break today. Now I'm breaking out my crown apple, okay? You're like, oh my God, crown apple. Yeah. See a little bit of crown in the bottom there? Like so. And they crown has other flavors, peach, vanilla, okay? Are they special? No, but they keep them kind of limited to make you hyped about them. So when they come on the market, you go, oh my God, finally I got crown apple, crown peach. I see what you're doing, crown one. Love it, okay? Manipulating the masses. Next up, we hit it with a little sour apple pucker. Sour apple pucker is little schnapps, okay? 15% alcohol, see it right there? 15% alcohol, you see what I'm saying? A little weaker, because it's just flavoring. But even though it's flavoring, it's still got to do a job. Get you just a little bit more tipsy. We come behind that with a little bit of this right here, apple juice. This is Mott's apple juice. I grew up on this. As a kid, this is what I was drinking. Mott's, okay? I didn't know anyone had a last name Mott's because it's a weird last name, but whatever. Put in a little bit of Mott's apple juice. Now we need some more green. So we coming behind here with this green apple soda. We're using Jules, but if you can't find a green, Soda, you could use a green juice. It's gonna be thicker, it's gonna be different, okay? Now hopefully this could turn out liquid green. You see, now we get a nice neat little green in there. So check this out, I grab my little apple, right? And I wanna decorate with some apple, you know? I wanna get some apple slices on top. So guys, check this out. We just do a little spread like so. We also got green apple candy. So we got the rings, and you wanna just put this around your straw. You still want them to know it's a straw, but you want them to, you know? Beautiful. And there you have it, the crown apple goblet, okay? Because this is what the kings drank back in the day, okay? They wasn't drinking from no little wine glass. I think wine glasses were just too, I don't know. I would, I'm gonna say weak for them, okay? Too sophisticated, okay? But when a man stands in his chamber and he holds up one of these goblets, I declare war. You see the, you see the difference, okay? Now if this was a little wine glass with some Chardonnay in it, no one taking that serious. He's drinking Chardonnay going to war? No, no, no. I declare war! You see? Much more meaning. Okay, let me hit this. God, that's good, okay? Drink responsibly, don't drink and drive. Stay tipsy! 